Hi guys, this is Weasel for Week Tight. This is a tutorial on how to use your microgaming hand histories with the Week Tight hand history converter. The first step is to make sure the client is configured to save a hand history. So we go to the Preferences tab here, then Hand History. And if we go to the Configuration tab here, we should see the option to check these boxes, store hand history for the last X amount of days. So make sure this box is checked, then go to Save Settings. So we're now going to play a couple of hands, then we're going to see if we can import these hands into the weak tight hand converter. So we'll jump on a table of 6 max 2 nl So we post here, obviously posting is not generally advised. And we don't really hit the flop that well, although we do have an overcard. And no one seems interested, so we'll put out a small bet here, see if we can pick up this pot. Okay, we get called. So probably we should be giving up, although it's certainly a reasonable barrel card, but we don't really have very good equity in this spot. So we just check back, maybe we spike a king or something. Ace should be a reasonable bluff card, actually. Let's, uh, let's fire a bet on the river. Very difficult for our opponent to call with any weak pair in that spot. 9-3, we're just going to check back in the big blind, and after this hand we'll sit out and see if we can import the hands into weak tight. We'll just check this flop, we have a very weak flush draw. Probably not good enough to be continuing with in this spot. Our opponent checks back, which is obviously a sign of weakness, so let's just lead the turn here. Again, see if we can pick up this pot. And our opponent folds. So we sit out and let's import these hands now into weak tight. So we go back to the main lobby. We go to preferences. We go to hand history again. And let's search for the last few hands we've played. And we can see here the king seven we played and also the nine three. So we have the option now to export these hands. So what we do is we click on one hand, we hold down the control key and select two of the hands we'd like to export. We go here to export hand history. And let's choose a location which we can find pretty easily such as the desktop. We'll maybe call it uh, micro gaming hands. We'll save it as a text file to our desktop. It says the game history has been exported, would you like to view it now? Let's choose yes. So now we have our hand histories in text format. Both of the hands that we played should be here. So we can see the hand with the 9-3 offsuit is here and the hand with the king 7 is here. So let's assume we would like to import this first hand. And the way we do this is simply by highlighting the entire hand. We go to right click, we copy. The next step is to open the weak tight hand converter which can be found at www.weaktight.com. If you haven't made an account already, the first step is to create an account. I've already created an account and signed in. In this box here where it says paste your hand history, we right click, we go to paste, press enter. Weak tight will now confirm whether it's a valid hand history or not and we can see it is indeed valid. It says valid hand history, prima, one cent, two cent, no limit hold'em. The next step is very simply to click post my hand and we should now see this represented in weak type format. So there's a few different options at the side which allow us to configure the output of this hand. Also of interest in the top right we see this replay button which allows us to view the hand in the weak type replayer which is perhaps a little bit easier than looking at the hand in the default weak type text format. This isn't the only way to import hands, however, many of you make use of tracking software such as Holder Manager 2 and Poker Tracker 4. It's also possible to convert the hands from your tracking software. So let's see how this is done by using Holder Manager 2. We can see here the two hands that we've played. We've already imported the King 7 directly from the text file. Now let's import the 9-3 using our tracking software. So the method is very similar. We simply right click on the hand we'd like to import into weak type. We go to copy. Once that's done, we head back to the weak tight converter. We click on post hand to post a new hand. And once again, we paste our hand history into here. We press enter. We wait for 
weak tight to confirm that it's a valid hand history, which indeed it is. Then once again we click post my hand and we should see our hand represented in weak type format. So it's definitely recommended you make use of this particular website. It's a very useful tool for sharing hands with your friends and also improving as a player. So thanks very much for watching this tutorial. This has been Weasel for weaktight.com.